trending news. The Northern Elders Forum are using Tinumbu to intimidate the Southwest. See details below. It's no news that the Economic Financial Crime Commission, which is EFCC, has been on trial to track down all fraudulent activities linked to the national leader of All Progressive Congress APC, the person of Chief Bola Ahmed Tinumbu. Chief Bola Ahmed Tinumbu, the former governor of Lagos State, have been faced with multiple charges leveled against him by EFCC as some suspected fraudulent activities that was said he is involved with in Lagos State. Many concerns, southerners and westerners have been talking about this for a long time now, but there have not been any solution or any evidence to prove that he is really a criminal or he is a fault. Since he has made his ambitions known to be going to the presidential race in the next election, Bola Metinubu has been faced with a lot of allegations in what seems as if his past has haunting, uh, sorry, his past is haunting him. But many people believe this, that this proving at this time is a form of intimidation from the north to dirty a person that believes could emerge as the president in the next election so that they can continue with ruling. But many people have been reacting and talking towards this development. Let's read one or two um, comments from individuals. Hmm. Let's also read videos. But before viewing videos, let's see comments from different individuals before I continue. Some said, I knew it would get to the level and how it will end. After helping Baba do a double 444, or 4 plus 4, which is 8, its reward is an EFCC probe, and we are not surprised that they or he will do such. We have been waiting for this for a long time now, for him to be executed, but all to no avail. Why? Because they have not gotten a tangible reason or a tangible allegation concerning that. Another one also said that a different person is heading the agency today. Can we give him a benefit of doubt? Is it true that we should allow him mess up before calling him Magu or Ko? He don't eat, he don't set. This is not the last bus stop for Bola Meti no more. Full and presidency, no they smile. Make we follow each other job. Lastly, the response of Nigerian individuals said, on the said until Southerners understand the EFCC has been weaponized by the Northern Oligacy to eliminate or intimidate both Southern leaders and other youths raided every day as suspected internet fraudsters to challenge its method in the South, that the South remain Concord and slaves to the north. So viewers, you have listened to one or two comments from Nigerians, from individuals concerning this report about Bola Tinumbo being in the custody of the EFCC. Since he has made his ambition known to be to be going to the presidential race in the next election, Tinubu has been faced with a lot of challenges or allegations uh, in what seems as if uh, his past is haunting him. But many people believe that this probe at this time is a form of intimidation from the north to dirty his person. And they believe that he could emerge as the president in the next election. That is why they have used they are using him to dirty they are, they are using they're trying to dirty his image so that the, the ambition of becoming president 
in 2023 will be a waste of time. But many people also have been re reacting and talking about this development as well. Men says that Bola Metinubu is not the problem of the country now. Insurgency is a problem. We believe that. So that is what the whole security network should focus on and leave Bola Metinubu at this critical moment. When security challenges is facing the nation, all we need to do is to focus on the issue that is facing or the challenges that is facing Nigerians and individuals and not a word or sorry not something that is not even relevant to um, Nigerians not something that will bring solution or a lasting solution that will, that will make or that will, that will stop insecurity in this country no like what um the moment we announced earlier on was talking about the uh, nin registration is that what we should be talking about is that the next step that we should take or should, have, or should take in this present state that we have in this challenging state that we have is that what you should be talking about that shows that it's not even care it's not which it's not even care if the citizens are in delima or not if they are suffering or not that is none of his business this is why he's not even saying anything about it and he's saying things that are not even relevant to nigerian citizens nigerian citizens are weeping they are in pains pleading begging that all this issue of insecurity should die down but not to no avail instead of worry encouraging Nigerian citizens on this issue of insecurity is bringing NIN registration, something that will not even put a stop to the crisis going on in this country, that will not even make you a, 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 a citizen, full, full citizens in Nigeria, or that will not make you travel abroad, or that will not make you, it's not, that, it's not something that will benefit from it, just it's, it's something that, you, that is, that is, related to your sim card that is rubbish so many believe the corruption fight is not willing and it is just a weapon to host him out so well let us see how the whole events will unfold as we have listened to what and the, uh, to the allegations leveled against the Tinumbu and the reason and also what the federal government should be looking at and not this issue of or that, not this issue that is not relevant so we need some of your comments below the comment box if you have any if you don't have please try and say one or two things concerning this we also need your opinion we also need your uh, comments please drop them below the comment box click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to receive updates whenever we upload any new videos and please don't forget click on the like button and also share this news thank you as you do have a wonderful day bye